Today is howdy howdy. Hello, hello. Hey, today is the first time I'm able to walk to work because the weather is awesome. Awesome. So there's no way I'm driving to work because I checked the weather. It's supposed to be in the 50s today. And, <coughs> excuse me, 60 tonight when I'm walking home from work, so. <coughs> Excuse me. As you can tell with the hair, it's windy. It's windy, but who cares, right? And <laughs> a snowplow just went by. <laughs> Uh-oh, do they know something I don't know? So, yeah. I know, I try not try, I do walk when the weather's nice. The only time when I drive to work is days like this. Yeah, it's, it's nice to be able to wear the old windbreaker for a change. Even it's too hot for that. Hello, Mr. Sun. How are you? Getting my rage before. Yeah. Good for little bear. Good for bear. My goodness. This is what we all need just for a little while. Just a couple weeks. It's a little normalcy back. So we can catch our breaths from the past year. Again, Anna Keith is closed five days a week. And if you ask me, that's pretty smart. Saving some money there. Oh, they took down the Jingle Bell tree. Thank goodness. I couldn't film around there because it was popping out Christmas music every three seconds. <laughs> Stood right there. Hey, game being the hills. <laughs> Elvis was peeping in the back there. For those of you who don't know Jane being the hills, please subscribe to them. I'll put the link in the description. They are huge Elvis fans. So anytime when I see Elvis, I think of John and Bobby. Not bad in here. Again, I can't be in here long because of the way they they uh, play the music. They're doing their spring cleaning. 
I've no, I didn't know Gatlinburg had a beautification division. My goodness. I need to put, <laughs> I need to be part of that, don't I, guys? Going around cleaning stuff up. I like that. Good for them. Good for them. Hello, Fanny Farkles. Hello, fattening corn dogs. I do not miss that place one single bit. My goodness gracious. God, if uh, serving takes a lot out on you. And especially when you've done it for 25 years. Tight turn there. That's why they get paid the big bucks. Hey, baby. <laughs> I've never been in here, not once. I don't plan on it. But let me ask you guys, who out there like things like this? You know, going to attractions like Star Cars to pay to look at cars that you can't drive. <laughs> I don't get it, but that's me. That's me. That'll be gone pretty soon. So quickly. Last night, Mega Millions, I don't think anyone won, but I received one number and it's the, like the, the, the big number, right? So I think I might have won five, six, seven dollars. I'm gonna go check it out right now. But really, all that money out there, 
and you get one win, you know, you get one winning number, the least they could do is give you a hundred bucks, right? Hello, hello. May I see how much, if anything? $2. How much? $2. $2. Wow, okay. <laughs> a billion dollar lottery and they give me $2. Is there a $2 scratch off ticket? Yes. Okay. I'll take that. Thank you, sir. Have a good day. Unbelievable. Holy $2. Well, and I, I don't got tickets, so, hey, I mean, what am I going to do, ask for $2? Wow. Come on, at least give me my $10 back. <laughs> oh, well. It is what it is. Well, okay, guys. I guess I'm going to work because I just want a ticket. Oh, my goodness. Look how slow town is. Love it. See the bridge up there, guys. My own dumping ground. Guys, it was so nice. I just went in there to say hi and I got a hug from the owner. I've known the owner since he was five years old. So, a lot of great memories there. So if you come to Gatlinburg and you want a local place that's been here forever, this is the oldest restaurant in town. So that right there should tell you how great they are. So if you would, go over there, send them some love, give them some love, tell them I sent you, okay? So, yeah, I love that place. I don't miss serving though. <laughs> Alright, time to head to work now. I see you, Rhonda. I'm thinking about you, hon. I say it all the time, but every time when I walk past this cottage, I think of our friend Rhonda. Yeah. Maybe one day, Rhonda, you and I will get our picture taken in front of there. <laughs> Guys, this is such a nice hotel, motel, however you want to say it. A friend of mine stayed here. And like I said a hundred times, if you get a motel or a hotel off the, the main parkway, it's so much cheaper. So much cheaper. Oh yeah, 
I've, I've shown this before. This is so cool. I love this tree. That is so cool. Almost looks like a pipe. <laughs> I'm gonna get behind the tree so I can block the sun. There we go.